It shouldn't come as a surprise that Tesla is leading the way among major automakers in both innovation and production. And the automobile manufacturer, with headquarters in California, is often considered to be the most progressive business in the whole world. The innovation strategy adopted by Tesla has led to an unprecedented level of machines and software integration within its factories. However, most other factories have not yet implemented such cutting-edge technology. But a new analysis that looked at all, all of the auto plants in the United States found that Tesla's factory is now the most productive operation. And only a few short years ago, several key companies in the automotive industry were skeptical that Tesla could ever become a significant manufacturer. After all, it was the only American automobile startup company since Ford that did not end up filing for bankruptcy. Over the past several years, Tesla has actually established itself as a significant automaker. As of the most recent quarter, the company produced more than 1 million vehicles annually. Hey guys, welcome back! In this video, let's talk about Tesla's plan to produce a massive increase in production starting this year and what it plans for the future. Now before I break this exciting news, make sure to smash the like and subscribe button and let's begin. Tesla's Gigafactory in Shanghai is responsible for a significant portion of this increase, but the manufacturer is also seeing expansion at its factory in Texas. As the global EV market continues to be turbulent, Tesla's facilities are ramping up the production of vehicles for delivery. And despite a challenging quarter, Tesla said in its Q1 2022 delivery and production figures that it delivered 310,000 electric cars, breaking its previous record. Now, Giga Shanghai's facility may deliver an impressive 14,000 to 16,000 electric vehicles each week, which produces more than 2,000 cars daily. The Giga Press, a 6,000-ton casting machine, is the key to company's ability to make so many automobiles at once. But a recent announcement by Tesla indicates the facility and sections of its supply chain have been temporarily shut down due to an increase of COVID-19 cases in Shanghai. And as a result, Giga Shanghai had to alter its delivery timeline. Giga Texas, like Giga Shanghai, has four Giga presses with a maximum daily capacity of 73 tons per machine. With this, the Giga Texas massive weapon will enable the facility to achieve large output and expedite the delivery of Model Y electric crossovers to consumers. Now, we've witnessed a comparison of the existing Tesla Fremont facility, which is spread out and not as efficient as it might be. Specifically, Elon Musk has compared the Fremont facility to Giga Texas, where everything is now housed under one roof. On one side, the raw materials are flowing in. With these new materials, a cell is now produced, a pack is made, and the front and back bodies are cast. Also, out of the package comes a completed product, so it's raw materials on one side and automobiles on the other. Now this demonstrates that Tesla learned a lot from the Fremont facility in California, where the buildings were completely separated. Due to frequent movement between facilities, Giga Texas can house all of its manufacturing operations under one roof, saving both time and money for the company's workers. According to Elon Musk, Giga Texas has the world's most advanced cell and this will likely become the world's largest cell plant in the future. The 4680 structural battery pack is another Giga Texas invention that speeds up car manufacturing and delivery. According to Tesla, a structural pack where the cells themselves support the weight, like current airplanes where the wing has a fuel tank and wing form, is the way forward. Now there is less weight in the new Model Y, which has a lesser number of parts, lower prices, and better crash performance thanks to a redesigned cell layout. There is also a sophisticated paint facility in the northeastern portion of the factory that adds considerably to the production process of Giga Texas electric vehicles. Multiple coats of paint are now possible in this paint shop, allowing for a more realistic appearance in a shift in hue that changes with the angle at which the light hits the body. With this, Tesla can make stunning works of art much more precisely because of this new technology. 
Next, the presence of a capable workforce at the Giga Texas facility is an essential component in the process of manufacturing and delivering electric vehicles. Over 10,000 individuals will be required by Giga Texas by the year 2022, which is double the minimum number of recruits the firm had first suggested. And it just came to light that Giga Texas already has more than 20,000 individuals on staff at the present time. Additionally, Tesla places a significant amount of emphasis on recruiting qualified individuals to work at its Giga Texas facility, particularly candidates with previous experience utilizing high-tech robots and innovative production technologies to assemble electric vehicles. In addition, some reports claim that Giga Texas has deployed 800 robots, with approximately a third of those robots being dedicated to the production of the Model Y by itself. Installing components like windows and seats, as well as constructing sub-assemblies such as battery trays and paintings, are two of the many activities that are taken over by these machines. They are ideal for repeated operations requiring high precision, fast speed, or heavy lifting. In addition, Giga Texas intends to use 60 Tesla bots in the not-too-distant future. Elon Musk claims that this humanoid robot from Tesla will be used for labor that is either tedious, hazardous, or both. He also mentioned that the production process is just as crucial as the product that is being produced. According to this point of view, modernizing the production method is not only a means to the end of global producing higher quality Instead, it is an essential priority. Now, when the production process is entirely optimized, the car delivery to the client will be sped up due to the increased efficiency. In the end, Tesla is seeing enormous growth at the present time, having delivered close to 1 million automobiles in the preceding 12 months. Tesla accounts for slightly more than 1% of the total deliveries made in the automobile sector worldwide. In the future, Tesla intends to give itself the challenge of reaching 20%. Elon Musk goes on to explain that this is the reason why size is essential. He said that in order to make a genuine impact, a very substantial difference to sustainability, the company needs to manufacture a lot of automobiles. He added that they need to make a lot of stationary packs in order to transition the globe to environmentally friendly technology as rapidly as we possibly can. Keeping all of this in mind, the next question is whether or if Tesla plans to grow into other regions where it does not already dominate like Southeast Asia. Leave a comment below with your comments or let me know what you think and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Now thanks for watching till the end. Before you go, make sure to like and subscribe and click the notification bell to trigger YouTube's algorithm and see more of our videos on your home page. Thanks for watching and see you next time for more interesting videos like this.